one kitchen, one ultimate chef, and three contestants because we have a 10 minute time schedule. Who's going to win? And who's going to be sliced on this episode of Sliced? Hello, and welcome everyone to Sliced. Today, our special guest star will be WG from The WG Show. Hey everyone, it's me, your favorite TV show host, WG. Uh, they're cheering for me. Oh, awkward. Anyways, let's take a look at our competitors for this episode of Sliced. Hey y'all, I've been a chef for about my whole life, and I love cooking pies. Like mainly pies. I also cook pastries a lot. Oh, that's the same thing? Whatever. Today, I'm going to be using my cooking talents to show the world just how powerful pies are. I've been cooking since I was five. Like the exact day I turned five. I love cooking all foods, but my favorite type would be smoothies. You can pretty much just put anything you want in a smoothie maker and you have something good. Or edible. Most of the time, anyways. I call it my turkey brownie shrimp supreme. Today on Sliced, everybody's gonna find out just how good of a chef I am. I have been cooking since I bought a frying pan. I love to fry stuff like cake. What do you mean you can't fry cake? I do have a bad habit of catching things on fire, but I do not let that stop me from living my dreams. Ah! My peanut butter is on fire! Today, I cook in a real kitchen because I burnt mine down last night. Now that you've met our contestants, it's time to meet the judges! Introducing Jordan Stanley, Angel May, and our new special guest star, WG, who we introduced earlier. So what are your thoughts on the contestants? Well, they're all definitely going to have their special techniques when it comes down to cooking. Like every contestant, they have potential. It's how they're going to use their skills that's going to matter. I think that they're all very weird and that this isn't going to end well. Well, anyways, let's get started! Welcome everyone to Sliced! I am just so excited to be here that I can, like, throw a pie in someone's face. For this challenge, you will all be making two courses of food, a meal and a dessert. Now please, open your picnic baskets. Inside your baskets, you should find a loaf of bread, eggs, an apple, a muffin, chocolate chip cookies, Coca-Cola, and a turkey. The timer starts! No! When I see these ingredients, I just immediately think these would taste great together in a smoothie. Over all my years of baking pies, I've learned one thing. You can make a pie out of anything. So I start right away on making my crust. I have decided to fry my foods since I know no other way of cooking. So I go to the pantry and I realize something. There's no smoothie maker. I was about to have a heart attack. Why isn't there a smoothie maker? Sorry, it's not my fault we don't own one. I don't have time to individually smush every ingredient. This is a disaster. After my pie crust is all ready, I just go right into mixing up all my random ingredients. So what do you think about Brenda's technique? Pie making can be easy or hard, but I think she knows what she's doing. All of these people are crazy. You can't just add all of your ingredients together and voila, an edible food. That's not how it works. What I love about smoothie making is that you can just add all of your random ingredients together and voila, it's edible food. So since there's no smoothie maker, I'm just going to be using the next best thing, a mixer. Hey, I kind of need that mixer. Well, my battery is in it, so you're just going to have to wait. <sighs> but I need it like right now. Brenda just won't let me have that mixer because she wants me to fail. Well, I'm not failing. Did you seriously just throw a turkey on me? Rosie is just jealous of me. I mean, it's obvious that my pies are gonna win this challenge. You can't just throw turkeys at me in my kitchen. Oh, we'll see about that. Oh my. This is a full on food fight. This show is even crazier in real life than it is on TV. Girls, girls, let's not. Ow! You know we have another mixer, right? What? Also, you have five minutes left. So, I have just thrown everything into the pan and then I leave it on the stove to cook. Ah! My food is on fire! Ah! Oh no, Skylar's food is 
burning. Uh, why isn't he getting a fire extinguisher? Uh, because we don't have one. What kind of cooking show doesn't have a fire extinguisher? We're Barbies! There's no such thing as a miniature fire extinguisher! That's very true. Oh no, this is very bad. Since my food is on fire, I get some water and pour it over my food. Phew, that was a close one. I thought I was gonna have to buy another kitchen. Look at the time. The contestants only have two minutes left. I have just a few minutes left and my pies ain't done. So I just throw everything together and hope it tastes all right. So I just put all of my ingredients in the microwave and they turn into this weird looking soup. I think it'll taste all right. I have one minute left and all my food has caught on fire. Three, two, and one. Time's up. Now time for the judges to judge. Do we have to eat this stuff? Yeah, unfortunately. So what I made for y'all today is a pie. Is... is this cooked? I hope so. <coughs> oh, very interesting flavor. Yeah, I can really taste the turkey in here. This is the worst pie I've ever tasted. I think I got the other two judges on my side, but that weird guy has some serious doubts about my pie making skills. So what I made for you guys today is a microwave soup complete with Coca-Cola. Uh, where's the Coca-Cola? Oh, it's in the soup. <laughs> now go ahead and try a bite. Sure, I'm glad I'm not a judge. Wrong. I think I'm gonna puke. <coughs> and now it's time for our final contestant, Skylar! All of my food has burnt, so I am left with nothing to serve you! I am so glad to hear that. And now the judges will make their decision on who's going to get sliced. So what did you guys think of Brenda's pie? Oh, it was way undercooked. It was just random ingredients all put into a pie. And the worst part was, it wasn't even cooked. That's definitely going to subtract a few points. And then there's Rosie's microwave soup. Woo! That stuff had a strong wang to it. Ugh! That stuff was so bad I puked. And then there's Skylar. Well, I think we know who won this challenge. And who's getting sliced. And the judges have made their decisions. All of you gave us very creative meal choices. And we know how nothing turned out exactly like you wanted. But the winner of this round is... Skylar! I hear my name called and I cannot believe I have won this round. How did he win? He didn't even present any food. I think that's exactly why. Now, for who is and isn't moving on to... to turn off the oven. Ah! Or I'll pee my kitchen. Quick! Everybody out of here! This couldn't have gone more wrong. Well, that's all for today's episode of The WG Show! Wait, I thought this was my show!